Good morning. Thanks for joining us for Local 3 News. I'm Brianna McLean, and joining us this morning is Alex with Taste of Local Difference. Thanks for finally being back in the studio. Oh, thanks for having me. <laughs> it is so great to be in the studio again yes. and being able to get together to talk about some things that are happening in our local food community. Yes, and today we are talking about smoothies. So yes. give me all the details. So usually I think if you've seen me here in studio, I usually haul my equipment in, but it has been busy. I'm sure just like the rest of you too. So I've been drinking a lot of smoothies, so I wanted to keep it simple. Um, mm -hmm. I'm actually featuring a smoothie that I've had on the Taste of Local Difference blog in the past. You can find it by going to our blog, mm -hmm. um, but it's really simple. It's a pint of blueberries, local of course, of course. Um, as well as a bunch of Swiss chard or beet greens, whatever types of greens you like, uh, as well as a cup of coconut milk, and then three tablespoons or so of local maple syrup, or you could use local honey as well. Really simple. You just blend that up and it's delicious. It's good for you, but it's great for on the go when you're busy this summer. Oh, yes. um, and I will love to tell you a little bit more about where you can get these blueberries as well as um, in case you need some things to keep you busy um, places to go and visit in the UP. All right and um, I'm sure it tastes pretty good hey. It tastes great. Um, I actually have already had one if you want to try it definitely oh, feel sh free to I? dive should in. I yeah it? I think you should give it a try. Okay. I want so it's, mm. you know what, like all those greens and everything, you think you would get those, but the maple syrup and the blueberries, I think, really help balance oh, it out. Man. It's incredible how healthy it is considering how good it tastes. It's sweet, but it is not too sweet. It's perfect. Awesome. <laughs> cool. Well, thank you so much. When we come back, I'll tell you more about where to get those blueberries and, like I said, some fun things happening in the UP. Great. I can't wait to hear all about it. All right, Tom, now over to you for a check on the forecast. Thanks a lot, Bree. As we look at our weekend outlook for today, bright, beautiful sunshine, high temperatures in the 70s to around 80, locally cooler near some shorelines of the Great Lakes. We do have a chance of rain showers and thunderstorms starting after sunset, and those rain shower and thunderstorm chances continue in the Saturday. Highs on Saturday, 70s to around 80, and then turning cooler for Sunday with highs in the 60s and 70s. For weather anytime, head to our WJMN Local 3 app, also online at upmatters.com. No social media issue thing, we're there as well at WJMN TV and our 906 Weather Watchers page.